Oh, so you're looking for some album reactions? This is the right place for you, my guy. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're looking at the next two songs from the album Wow 2011. This song is called Mine Mine, the only English title on the album. Let's see what happens. <laughs> First of all, that's funny. He goes careless, passed by the lane, and I found your car parked in the tollway zone. I paid the fine for you. <laughs> you don't want my care? That's funny. That's funny. But you know what? I was listening and I was like, whoa. I don't think he needs auto tune for this song. I don't know why he added auto tune. But you know what? He's great. He's a creative artist. He can do as he wants. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I like that confidence. He's like, listen, doesn't that make you feel silly when we meet up again after we make up? Which is implying that they're gonna break up in a makeup. Cockiness. Loving it. <laughs> Let's see what happens. <laughs>
that song was crazy. Do you know what? I'm gonna just say, yeah. Should I rate it first? I'm gonna rate it 8 out of 10. Nothing crazy, but nothing bad. So, yeah. Do you know what? Let me tell you why. This song, I felt like without the auto tune, I would have said, This is classic J Chow. So nice, so sweet, so sad. But you know what? The auto tune basically made it like the new J Chow remix the old one they come together to team up but I feel like he didn't need the world tune but at the same time I feel like it might have spiced up the mix I feel like it would have made the you know like the end part when it's vocalizing I feel like he just wanted to polish that up and he wanted to use the world tune which is fine he can do that sounds good but yeah that song was nice the lyrics he was having fun he goes I like the beginning part you already heard what I said about that but the point of the story is basically saying like he's basically saying at the end of the day they're gonna be together, he's hers, she's his, so sweet, let's not fight. That's what I get from the lyrics anyway, but you know what? I'm gonna say that's a happy song. Cause I see what he was trying to do. He was trying to like, make like a smooth, do you know like Weekend Snow Child? Like that, look. It reminded me of that. <clears throat> you know that Weekend song, Snow Child? It reminded me of that. And I imagine, do you know when the Starboy album came out and everyone was going crazy over the weekend's do you know when Sidewalks, he comes in with auto-tune, everyone's going, what's going on? You got a nice voice? Why are you using auto-tune? But then I feel like, why not? 2021, mate. But this is obviously not 2021, but you know what I mean. They can do it if they want to do it. So yeah, that was a good song. 8 out of 10. That's actually pretty good. So yeah, let's move on to the next song. We have Princess Syndrome. I don't know what that means. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Who is that? What's going on? Fast.
was crazy. That was nice. First of all, I just want to say, yeah. Do you know that voice he does? Like a baby voice. I'm not a fan of that voice. It's catchy. It's still very catchy. But I'm not a fan of that little... I don't even want to do it, but the baby, it's like he's speaking through his nose, it's a bit nasally. But you know what? You know the part when his vocals comes in like a strong man? I can't do it, but you know the part I'm talking about. That part was nice and sweet, I love it. But that song, very sweet, very nice, talking about the princess. Talking about how he's going to help her out, forget about all the boys, whatever. Yeah, nice meaning, nice little sweet song. Also, the lyrics was a bit repetitive, but it was still very catchy. I liked it very much. And yeah, also the last thing I want to say about that song, when the beat switched halfway through, that was different, it was nice, it caught me off guard, I was a bit like, okay, then the beat switched and it brought me back in, I was like, okay, this is nice. So for that one, ooh, do you know what, I'm going to have to give that one, I can't give it too crazy, because it didn't blow my mind. From now on, the only songs getting 9 and 10 is the songs that blow my mind and I go crazy. Those are the songs that get 9s and 10s. So for that, I'm gonna give it... Oof. It was a happy, sweet song, yeah? But at the same time, I don't wanna hype it up too much. So I'm gonna have to say 7.5. So far, the album's going like this. Every song, except for the first one, being very happy. So, 7.5. Sorry about that, everyone. But do you know what? Oh, wait a minute. Oh no. Unfortunately, that's all we have time for today. But guess what? Videos dropping every day. You know the law. And yeah, check out my previous video. I dropped it the other day. The mukbang. Very nice. I was having all of this. Very nice, mate. So yeah, also, everyone was laughing at me. Having the whole seeds, mate. I don't know. How am I supposed to know? I don't eat seeds. <laughs> but you know what? It was fun. It was a good video. And yeah, I got some interesting videos coming soon. Keep an eye out for that. See you next time, mate. The instructions are oh, mmm, spicy hot. Ah, are you dumb? Am I supposed to eat this? Then have to push it down. Oh.